Hello guys, today I'll be showing you how to model this uh, cage, okay? Very simple and easy and yeah, let's begin. I'm gonna hide all these, including the camera and the light as well. Press H to hide. Alright, now we'll press 1, Shift A, add a cube. Alright, GZ1, okay? So it's on the top of the red, okay? And now, let's make, oh, I'm gonna show you, some might say, if you want to make a cage, you just go subdivide a few times like that and press I twice. Oh, where is it? Oh, press I twice like that and delete face. Oh, that didn't work because I double those. Let me do it again. Okay, now press I, delete face. And you got something like that. Actually, it's fine, but it's up to you how you want to do it. But I'm not going to make it like this, okay? I'm going to I'm gonna go with something like a little bit professional. Maybe professional, maybe not. Could say good for beginners. So I'm going to delete this cube now. Shift A to add another cube. And this one, there you go. GZ1. Alright. And now, let's not do anything now. Let's go to modify, okay? Go to till you see the wireframe over there. Select the wireframe, okay? But no, let's not do that yet. Let's subdivide. Go to edit mode. Shift. Uh, what? Oh, just right click. Subdivide. <laughs> All right. I subdivide till about two, three, four. I think five looks good. Yeah. Subdivide till five looks good. All right. And now we can wireframe this, okay? Make sure you object over there, Got the modifier, and use the wireframe, okay? So now I'm gonna say this. Uh, it actually the preview didn't work on what do you call this in edit mode, okay? You have to go in object mode. So I'm gonna press tab, or you can just go to here, click that one, go to object mode. Now see, now it works on that way. I don't know why, but Okay. Okay, we got something like that. Now we got our cage over there. It's up to you. You can mess this around, and you can add uh, the bevel later. Okay. But first, let's mess this around. See what it does. Thickness. Uh, I think I want it a little bit thicker. Offset. What's this? Even. I'm gonna make it even. Oh, I'm, I'll make it even. All right. So I think I just need that one. Okay, so I I don't want to miss anything with this relative. Mm, nope, I don't want that. Andre, I didn't see anything. Maybe there is, but I, I I don't see it. Okay, so I I just want that. Okay, how about the offset? Oh, right. Okay, control Z. Okay, so now we got that wireframe. Let's control A to apply. Now let's go to to the bevel, okay? There we go. And you should see something like that. Increase the, uh, not the amount, the segment. Uh, as many as you like, but, oh, I'm gonna go with three would do. Yeah, three would do. And if you want, this one, maybe this. Oh, that's the angle. Wait, no, I don't want that vertex group. Uh, no, I'm just gonna stick the angle. Profile. Custom, if you want custom, you want to make something like this, just add a few dots. Oh, add another one there. And you go to there. Just mess them around and yeah, look at something like that. Okay, but I don't want that. I'm just going to go something simple today. Geometry, there we go. Let me zoom. All right, let's mess this one. Okay, how about patch? Nope, arc. Okay. Well, look at that, guys. Look at that. We make a mistake, but it, it actually looks very cool, okay? <laughs> Try it yourself. Mess this thing around. Who knows what you're going to find, okay? So let's go back to this one. Shop and shop, okay? I'm just going to arc. Uh, no. The section, okay. I think I'm just going to go with that one because uh, that actually looks fine now. Me uh, shade smooth, right click shade smooth. 
right? I don't think that's going to be a problem. Yeah, that's not going to be a problem there. It's not brown, but yeah. You can mess everything here, okay? Mess all of them. Until you got something that that you're liking. Oh, I should mess this one. What wait? Oh, wait, wait there. Oh, nothing. Angle. Well, it's just changing a little bit. Okay. How about wait? Yeah. So I'm just gonna in order to fix that, just go to here. Normal, all is smooth. But that's a bad idea. Okay. Because I want this to be smooth. So let's go back to here. Uh not to wait, just back to angle. Alright. I think that would do. Because I don't need to use this anymore. Because if I does, I didn't change a lot. But I'm just gonna stick to like that. Alright. So we got our cage over there. It's almost done. Let's apply the bevel. Control A to apply, make sure in object mode. And control A, make sure your cursor is over here, okay? Or you can just go to here and just click that one. Okay, should go something like that. Now let's select all, press M by distance. Whoa, we got lots of doubles. So yeah, good thing we get rid of it by pressing M. Okay. Now let's make the door. So how to make the door? Well, we can just use bo boolean for that. Shift A to add anything you want, but I'm gonna make the door using the cube now. Oops. Press one, scale, grab that to the Z, scale, uh, something like, oh, it's small. All right, that would do. Grab that below, something like that. Okay, that would do. Not, not reaching this one. Okay, now grab this to the Y. Don't worry about that one. Okay, we can fix this one. Maybe we can just bring them up a little bit. G. And this one. If you're using a mirror, it's very good using a mirror, okay? Using a mirror, it's actually saving a lot of time when it comes to something like this. And this one. For now on, I'm just doing something custom. Not using a mirror. Alright. Now, select this both. Make sure this one is highlighted orange, okay? And I'm gonna press N and then choose auto boolean difference. Oh well I make a mistake. <laughs> what mistake is that? Control Z. Actually this one is supposed to be the highlighted orange, okay? <laughs> so I'm gonna redo it again. Select that one. Ah make sure it's this one, okay? This one is the orange and this one I don't know what for yellow. And press difference. So it should go something like that. Press N to hide that panel. Look at that. Look at that, guys. Look at that. You got yourself a cage there. Very simple and easy, okay? So I'm not going to paint. I'm just going to show you how to model this, okay? So, yeah. That's all for today. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you next time on the next tutorial. Okay, now. See you later.